Welcome to Things You Should Know, The Great War. Today we're going to talk about the Battle of Frizenberg, part of what is called the Second Battle of Ypres, located near Ypres, Belgium, with British Commander Herbert Plummer and his six British divisions, consisting of approximately 59,275 men, and French Commander Henry Gabriel Putz, with his two French divisions consisting approximately of 22,000 French soldiers. They are facing off with German Commander Albrecht of Wittenberg, with his seven divisions of 35,000 men, on May 8th to the 13th, 1915. After the Battle of St. Julian and a new style of gas attacks the Germans had implemented, the British were stunned as the Germans began to move their heavy field artillery forward, taking the Frisenberg Ridge opposite the British 27th and 28th Division. On May 8th, the German artillery let loose their fury, targeting the British 83rd Brigade, who was located in the trenches opposite them. The Germans launched their infantry attack on the survivors of the artillery bombardment, but were surprised when they were repulsed not once, but twice during the battle. Pulling forth more reinforcements, the German third attack was more successful, pushing the British out of the trenches and opening the gap of more than two miles in the British line. As the Germans were about to take advantage of this gift, they were stopped by Princess Patricia's Canadian Light Infantry and the 10th Brigade's counterattacks. The bravery of these Canadians was of the highest order. They pushed the Germans out of their own trenches and back to the original starting point of the Germans. This can be shown as the number of those who served in Princess Patricia's Canadian Light Infantry started at 700 men that morning, and by that evening when they were relieved at less than 150 men plus four officers. It should be known that even to this day, Princess Patricia's Canadian Light Infantry's unofficial motto is holding up the whole damn line. As we said though, during the Battle of St. Julian, the overall Second Battle of Ypres did not break out losses other than what we brought you up about Princess Patricia's Canadian Light Infantry, and I love the name of that unit, by the way, into these smaller battles. The total numbers will be reported during the last battle, the Battle of Belle which will be coming up in a few weeks. Join us next time on Things You Should Know, The Great War.